right, hello everyone. Welcome back. All right, riding the Rad Rover today. Wow, that, that corner was a little crowded. All right. Feels windy today. I'm gonna be taking mostly the streets. I aired up the tire. I gave it uh, gave it a look. I dusted the brakes a little bit, but rear squeaking probably needs to be adjusted. clubhouse but I'm gonna make videos a little different now I'm gonna use a lot of time lapsing and warp speeding and selfie video vlogging ish type of content here okay got a green light pedal assist uh, five gear seven up the tires to 20 psi made sure it says that they were already 20 psi but it felt it didn't feel like it when I uh, when I aired up uh, when I checked the tire pressure when I rode during uh, the snow blast it said 10 psi and now it says 20 i think it's i think it could be possible you know the cold weather but i don't know by 10 psi that's kind of a lot but maybe my gauge was off who knows anyways i checked the tire pressure it, it sounds quieter <laughs> Before it was like, zzz, zzz, because see, it seemed a little flatter, more contact on the ground, but on the tire from the last video ride. Anyways, I, uh, it is really windy today. Woo! Anyways, uh, I'm going to go to the clubhouse. I'm not going to work out. I worked out yesterday. I did, I did uh, calisthenics, work, you know, using my own body weight to uh, work out my muscles. So I'm headed, uh, I'm doing just cardio right now. So. My back, this is my back. I'm still having lower back pain. I took some ibuprofen this morning, so a lot of the uh, aching or discomfort has gone away, most of it. But yesterday, I did ride the bike. Uh, I also did some yard work and all this other stuff. So yard work always makes my back ache, especially my right side of my back. So, anyways, I guess something I'm going to have to live with or deal with from this point on, but, so, whatever you're doing in life, whatever your situation, if you have the opportunity to do what you want to do, you should do it. You should do it. Don't doubt yourself, no regrets because you may not be able to do it <laughs> physically. Some of the physical things you may not be able to do. You know, whether you have 
especially for a man with erectile dysfunction or you know some kind of some kind of cardiovascular disease or a physical disability something you may not be able to do so while you're still able and you have your uh, you have the ability you should go ahead and do it <laughs> you should do it you know don't go crazy don't blow your life savings on going on a wild spree but you know and, and within reason and good health don't do anything that would cause injury or uh, you know give you a disease or anything or an illness but anyways anyways you don't want to hear that you want me to ride the bike tell you how great it is and you should all buy one and you know the bike will change your life you would you, you have to ditch your car which I didn't ditch my car I just drive it less I still own it I still drive it too I'm not gonna abandon uh, I'm not gonna abandon fossil fuels fossil fuels has been the most reliable source of energy as of date so uh, anybody who talks about fossil fuels and getting rid of it they're crazy they're smoking crack looks like the middle school has a little fire drill fire alarm drill going on pushing my legs a little bit Ooh, check the bike and everything make sure everything's at least uh, looks like it's okay it's not gonna fall apart on me <laughs> like my front my front skewer I don't maybe, maybe because of the cold and heat cold and heat the front skewer kind of got loose and I'm looking at it right now and I know that it's on because remember I have it I have it latched upwards so just in case it gets loose, it can, it'll, it'll start falling over. If you have it down, you'll never know that thing's, you know, getting loose. So, and my brake is a lot better on the front wheel. It was, it was like pulling the wheel, moving the wheel around. I was like, this is weird. So, anyways. Anyways. This Rad Power Bikes is, uh, I think, officially three, probably three years old here. 2018, 19, 20, 21. It actually might be four years. Anyways, uh, at this point, we'll uh, we'll get to uh, time warping. So enjoy the ride. It's sunny today. See you on the other side.
Hey everyone, I'm, I'm at the, I'm, I'm technically at the clubhouse. The clubhouse is over here, um, or yeah, it's actually back here, the, the porch where I stay at, but uh, they're power washing it, so it's kind of closed, which I don't mind. Uh, beautiful day at the lake, nice and sunny. I'm just gonna enjoy it. Uh, the the COVID restrictions has been lifted and uh, you're gonna see a lot of, uh, where are they? A lot of kids out here, a lot of kids out here enjoying the day and I don't blame them. Uh, I personally, I wouldn't yet. I'd, I'd probably take a little wait and see approach. That's just me. But uh, let's take a look at the lake here. All right. There's a few birds out there. Let me see if I can zoom in. Feel of see them right there. They're on the uh, island. I think those are birds. Some of them has got to be birds. So very nice. Very nice indeed. Anyways. So yeah, uh, <laughs> uh, beautiful day. Uh, maybe they will open the pools up. Maybe they will open the pools up and there's no restrictions required. Uh, I know the uh, fitness center is open. Looks like the fitness center is open. Uh, I'm not gonna be working out today. Uh, if they open up the pools, I'll try to get here early. I don't, I don't know if I'll go in and when it's crowded. Uh, before you have to have, you have to make it a, a reservation and then you can only be there for about two hours. If they lifted the restrictions, that means anybody can go anytime, no matter, no matter what. So um, I'm, I'm happy, but I'm concerned. But uh, overall, if it works out, I'm gonna take a wait and see approach myself. Look at that, look at the bike. All right, I guess I'm gonna leave here. I just wanna get some cardio, and get some uh, exercise, uh, just to manage my energy intake and outtake.